I'm here with LC Bird, senior guard, Jamon Dock, Battle of the Skyhawks, win at 89 to 56 over Lake Taylor here in the Gray Elm Tip Off Classic. And the MVP Dock Battle, 25 points, 12 rebounds, 6 steals. All right, I know different cast of characters for your team and their team, but last year this is the team that beat you up in Richmond. How personal was it to like, all right, we want to kind of keep rolling at a high level and not let someone beat us that beat us before? Basically, last year they beat us about 20 something. And they posted it all on social media. Had 38 on this, 38 points on a person. So this year we had to take it personal. We still mm -hmm. took it professional, but we took it personal at the end of sure. the day. Well, and you almost had 30. You had 25. <laughs> Even early on when the shots weren't falling, you were attacking the rim. Did you want to kind of come out with the mindset of, like, I'm going to the hoop as much as possible and either scoring or setting someone up to score? Yeah, mainly I started out the game trying to attack the rim because I knew last year I did the same thing. Mm -hmm. It opened up a lot of shots for my team. It's, it got us way better this year. We were way better chemistry team this year. We got a, got, um, a lot of guys with relationships on the team and stuff like that. You're known as one of the better two-sport athletes in the state. How has your basketball game changed from last year to now? Basketball, I think my game took a big jump. I had a couple of things that I couldn't do last year. It's like, it felt different. I can't believe like how much work I put in and actually got me better. Mm -hmm. Have you made more improvement, you think, on the offensive end or defensive end? Yeah, I've, been try I've been improving on the defensive end, but my game took a big jump on the offensive end. Defense also, because I always think defense first. Right. But on the offensive end, I can add a couple things other than drive, so people won't just back up on me. I can shoot a couple more things like that. Mm -hmm. This bird team is similar to a couple of bird teams from years ago when you had to play them. That matter of fact, I mean, some of the weapons you have in front of yourself, Lance Montero, Tyler Henderson at the point, Matt Berger inside, Malik Conaway, Everett Rivers. Do you feel like anybody can get hot from deep at any time? You know, I love those guys, man. It's like, I don't know who's going to get hot. I don't even got to think about who I'm going to pass to in the corner. I know if I pass it in the corner, it's a knockdown shot. And if it's not, I'm going to kick it to him again, another knockdown shot. Mm -hmm. That's why I love him so much. We all fair. Mm -hmm. A few more for you. You've scored 80 plus points in each of your first three games. I know there's still some tough tests that wait. Uh, Brian is on the horizon. But what is Coach Mann's kind of harped on in order for this team to be at a championship level? What are the things he's kind of outlined for you? He harped on basically the same leadership. You know, we got to take it, take it in and get our younger guys better, not even us better. For those coming up from home, we got to make everybody accountable for it, make all this better. Hopefully, more championship other than just a future championship. Our JV team practice with us. Let's talk about recruiting for a second. What's the update? I know Hofstra was in the building today to watch you play. I know you're getting football and basketball attention. What's kind of your your thought with it right now, and who's kind of showing you the most love at this point? Um, recruiting is going good right now. There's been a couple other schools texting me: uh, Murray State, Hofstra, Tennessee, Providence, a couple other coaches have uh, coach up. It's like, I gotta take it one step at a time. Okay. So, Pretty cool to have a school come away from New York to see a boy. I mean, I know he's a hometown guy in Coach Bear, but. I mean, what, what, do you, what do you think of them right now? Are they pretty high on your list, or? Yeah, they're pretty high on my list. Coach Bear showed me a lot of love. I got a lot of respect for Coach Bear. That's why I, I stay in contact with one of them. Hopefully, it comes down to make the best decision I can. Okay. Now, you were getting a lot of attention we talked back in the summer with both sports. Are you leaning in basketball right now? Or? Yeah, I'm leaning towards mostly basketball because that's why I, I got to strive to put the most work in for. I can get okay. better each and every day in basketball. Okay. And lastly, what do you want people to see out of Jamon Dot Battles game this year? You're a senior before you get up to the next level. What do you want them to take away when a fan comes to the building and watch you play basketball? I want them to take away that they like seeing me play. I ain't no bad kid, not a bad attitude. They just like seeing how much impression I got from the corner, how much a good attitude I got. That's a, um, the best thing I work with. Well, great performance for Doc Battle and the Skyhawks. 25 points, 12 boards, 6 steals, and most importantly, a W. Thanks so much. We'll see you soon. Yes, sir.